like number three. We messed up that guy really bad in the surgery. Is that a... Uh... Yeah, definitely. size of this bag. It's disgusting. Dude, that's your patient. Say what now? Rovio is an independent Finnish video game developer and publisher founded on 2003. This team works mainly on creating tons of mobile games. You're one of the most well-known childs of this company, Angry Birds, released on December 2009. You became a gaming phenomenon and one of the most downloaded apps on phones since then. Many spin-offs follow you. Seasons, Rio, Space, Star Wars, Stella, Go, Pub, Bad Pigs, 2, and even Transformers. So that covers all your history, so let's do this quickly and open your mouth and... Ow! Oh, are those worms? Ugh, I hope there's better things in here. You're a physics-based puzzle with a very specific objective. Throw homicidal birds from a slingshot into cheap structures made by pigs with serious skin conditions. Why? Because these pigs were hungry and decided to steal the birds' eggs. Okay. You're divided into chapters, and each one have a certain amount of levels that varies from 30 to 45. But overall, there's over 500 levels. As your name may suggest, the main protagonists are these birds. Balls each one having a different ability and weakness. Dash through wood, throw an explosive egg, dash through glass, inflates and push everything around, make bubbles, among others. Knowing that, the main objective is kill all pigs on every level and cause as much destruction as possible. Players will be awarded with a star if they manage to complete a stage but according to the destruction they can achieve, they will be awarded with a second and third star. There may be easy levels to get three stars, but a lot of them require precision and some thinking. You give players a limited number of birds on each level, which will be essential to beat it. They can throw any birds they want to kill the pigs, but players will only achieve three stars if they think properly on how to use each bird to cause massive destruction. The purpose of getting 3 stars is to unlock secret levels in the form of golden eggs. And these eggs can also be found on some levels. Your style is very simplistic, which is good, there's no need for a lot of details on the birds and backgrounds, since it's a very simple game. And also you like to throw some new mechanics as the player progress in the form of unlocking new birds, environmental hazards, and even give some birds new powers. Now that we're done with that, uh, you will have to bend over and don't think much about it. It will be done quickly. So, <coughs> yeah. Besides the main title, there's not a single track played during the stages, which makes you feel awkward sometimes. Even if each level has a different puzzle, the gameplay never changes and throwing birds can get a little repetitive from time to time. It seems the only reason the red bird is the mascot of the series is to give him some relevance, because in the end he doesn't do much. Hell, there's even a special chapter dedicated to him feeling useless, even if the levels can be beaten using as many birds as the player wants, and destroying as much as they want or can, there's almost only one way to beat the stage and get 3 stars which can get a little frustrating at times. And those golden eggs, they are okay levels. But achieving all 3 stars on a chapter just to get one level that can be beaten under a minute, uh, does not seem worth it. It does not seem And what the hell is this shit? <laughs> so wrapping things up, you're an addicting app with good gameplay and smart level design but you're gonna get a little repetitive after a while. There's a disturbance on the medical force that is telling me that you're worth a 7 out of 10. A good game, but you're better as a distraction or a time waster.
God damn it, playing. And I just want, I just want to do this video with this duck here. I don't know why I have 